And I remember sitting down one day writing the, um, the rent check to pay the rent for the facility. And I'm like, I just can't do this anymore. I just, I don't got it in me. So I don't know if we finished up another three, four months. I didn't renew my lease and we basically just shut her down and sort of, I'm the same thing again. I'm like, oh my gosh, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I'm at the end of my rope. And this time I'm just emotionally tapped out, but this is what I know. This is what I do. This community sort of knows me as, you know, this, this fitness guy, this fitness guru. Um, so I started to get back into it <clears throat> and I built it back up again, tried to do a little smarter this time. I'm working a little bit more, you know, on the business instead of in the business. And, you know, we did some really good aggressive marketing campaigns and stuff and built this thing up to be pretty nice. And it was going super good again. And we had a new location and then COVID hit. Now COVID hit and at the time in 2020, if you couldn't go to a gym, you couldn't do anything in person. So it's funny because on one hand, I was like, thank God, I'm so burnt out again. This was, you know, it's been going good for the last few years, but I, I don't know if I can just keep doing this. And I, it was a wake up call for me. But on the other hand, that took care of my revenue, you know, so we were wiped out for a few months. I had nothing, it gave me some time to sort of figure out how I'm going to do things or what I'm going to, you know, what my pivot's going to be. So I started this online coaching, um, high performance coaching, executive coaching, which I take the fitness and the health side of it and then tie it into more personal development as well. Because I believe there's a a strong synergy between the success that we can have with our fitness routine and taking care of our health and our heart and our muscles and our mind. And it can bleed over into having success professionally in our daily habits, in um, our environment, in, in those that we surround ourselves with. So I think there's a lot of synergy between fitness and in business growth in, in, in the strategies to become successful.